in this short documentary video will be discussed on topic of vibration control in a washing machine. Hello everyone, have you ever heard about vibration? Yes, of course. Vibration happens on almost things. The thing that always vibrates near to you is your handphone, of course. But I wonder how bad vibration can be. Today we will focus on washing machine because washing machine is the thing that we need every day. Yes, I know your machi washing machine is good, doesn't vibrate at all, but you don't know at all about vibration. On this short documentary, I will reveal to you how how bad vibration can happen. There are three important parameters in vibration system that you need to understand. The first one is mass which relates to the motion of a rigid body. Mass store kinetic energy. The second one is the stiffness which corresponds to the deflection of a flexible component. And this stiffness component store a potential energy. The third one is the damping. The function of the damper is to absorb the vibration energy. These three elements were applied inside the washing machine in order to control the vibration of motor during operating. Here is the diagram component inside the washing machine. From this diagram, we can convert it into spring mass damper diagram. It stops loading washing machine that commonly used by people in our country. The common problem of this washing machine is moving from the original position because of the vibration during it. There are three lines of the picture. The blue one for the right and the green one for the left. While the yellow one for the original position. As we can see on the video, the washing machine moved from the original position to the right. How this happened? The first one is improper feed leveling. This is because the feet of the washing machine having a gap between the floor and cause the appliance moving from its position. The second is unbalanced load. A single large wet item such as a comforter or blanket can hug one side of the washer during the spinning, throwing the washer off balance and causing it into vibrate. In previous video, you already see how the vibration on washing machine. The washing machine moved from its original position to some point. In the next video, I will show you how to overcome this problem. We have two types of solution. We use spun as the first solution. The spun was placed under the washing machine. The function of spun is to absorb excessive vibration from the washing machine. We can say that the spun is the additional damper for the system. For the second solution, we use a rubber mat. Same with the first solution, we put rubber mat under the washing machine. The washing machine stops moving around because the rubber mat prevents appliance from unwanted movement across the floor. It also reduces the noise that came from the feet of washing machine and floor. Here are the recommendations. As we know, during the spin cycle, vibration occurs the most. So to avoid this problem, you can put additional damping or isolation. This thing does not eliminate the vibration, but it will reduce the problem. And for the last part, I hope you understand all about this vibration on washing machine. And thank you for watching this documentary.